Right, I'm Randy Harris. I uh, work at the University of Waterloo in the Department of English Language and Literature, and I'm also the research director of the Rhetoricon database. I work at the intersection of linguistics and rhetoric with a side order of uh, cognitive neuroscience and artificial intelligence. Randy Harris is a really terrific writer, the likes of which you rarely find among uh, academic writers. So, The significance of my work um, is that it brings uh, rhetorical patterns to the understanding of language in a very systematic kind of way that, that hasn't been explored before, so that we can find argumentative and inferential patterns in large bodies of discourse. Once we know uh, what these patterns mean, we can, we can envision a time when we can find five, six, seven nodes apart in a huge corpus, maybe a treatment regime um, that, that correlates with a syndrome that no one could ever encounter. But above and beyond uh, traditions and specific people who have inspired me, it's the daily uh, creative traffic in language that I find uh, really inspiring. The, the moment-to-moment creativity that, that, that you encounter at, at uh, bus stops and in hallways, the way people combine and recombine and, and recycle uh, language in certain, in certain um, renovating patterns. But these patterns follow specific neurocognitive and social and cultural grooves. And I study how this creativity uh, follows those patterns. So the actual day-to-day use of language I find tremendously inspiring as well.